Hello and welcome to the sixth video in the Giga News Usenet University tutorial series. Up to this point, we've explained how to connect to Usenet, how to subscribe to news groups, and various methods of searching for articles. This video will examine the other side of participating in Usenet, posting your own articles for others to read. In essence, posting an article to a news group is just like sending an email. Except your email in this case can be read by anyone that subscribes to the news group. We'll be using Microsoft Outlook Express and Newsbin Pro to show you how easy it is to post your own articles. Let's start with Microsoft Outlook Express. Select the news group you wish to post to in the left pane. Click the New Post button and type the subject and body of your post. If you want to post to multiple news groups, you can click the News Groups button to select more, or manually enter the names of the news groups into the text field next to News Groups. When your post is complete, click the Send button. Since Outlook Express is an email client first and foremost, posting is understandably easy. Let's see how it's done in Newsbin Pro. Right click on the news group that you want to post to and select Post to Group. Enter the name and email address to display with your post. If you decide to use your real email address, remember to enter some fake details to protect against spam. Next, enter the subject and body of your post. If you want to post to more than one news group, enter the names of the news groups into the text field next to Groups. When your post is complete, Click the Post Now button at the bottom of the window. As you can see, posting is a simple task in Newsbin Pro as well. At this point, we've covered all of the bases you need to enjoy and participate in Newsnet. Our next video, the Giga News Accelerator, is about Giga News's proxy based Usenet software designed to improve your header download speeds by up to 10 times normal speed.